receptionist. Yes, sir. No, sir. Three bags full, sir. Ain't much more to it, is there? What time is Mr. Davis collecting his car bomb? Oh, was I meant to write that down? <clears throat> oh, if you're after a mechanic, we're fully booked till next week. Oh, actually, it's about Sharon. Oh, yeah. She sent you to do her dirty work, has she? Whatever's happened, Keanu, she loves you. I mean, you know that. Whatever's happened? Like her making sure he never sees his kid again, you mean? Oh, you don't know, do you? I'm surprised you ain't heard about the voicemail in the pub. I've been away. She helped Lisa take Peggy away. Went behind his back. Let her snatch his daughter. I'm sure she didn't mean any harm. <laughs> Sharon said it herself. We, we tried and it didn't work. So, we're Albie's parents, that's all. Didn't even know you guys were close anymore. It's like a stubborn old Veruca. Just when you think you got rid of her. Um, and next time, maybe get your facts straight before she sends you to do her skivvying. Right, and what? Not enough for you, is it? Ruining our friendship, our chance of going into business, or no? You had to go in for the grand prize and wade into my love life and all. I was just trying to help. I've just had Karen at the boxing den, accusing me of sending my lapdog. And just as me and Keanu agreed to be adults about all of this, you go storming over there like a kid in the playground. I'm sorry. All right, I overstepped. But you're my friend. <gasps> oh, I'm not your friend. And the sooner you get that into your head, the better. I said 